Abu Ali Al Hussein Ibn Abdullah Ibn Sina. He is known as the father of modern medicine. Ibn Sina was born in Afshana, near the city of Bukhara in 370 Hijri. He died in 428 Hijri in Hamadan, Persia, at the age of 57 years old. His father, Abdullah, was a local governor and his mother's name was Setare. Among his areas of contributions are medicine, philosophy, pharmacology, astronomy, geology, physics, and poetry. His early life, Nusina received his early education at the age of 16. He dedicated all his efforts to learn medicine, and by the time he was 18, he gained the status of a famous physician. Famous works were The Canon of Medicine, Surah al Shir al Ra'is, Kitab al Najat, and Kitab al Shifa. His general view on nerves, vessels, and the heart. Sina suggests that muscle can only move with supporting nerve. He also explained that kidney and spleen are covered by nerves but not visible by naked eyes. Next, he described the presence of valve at the RT outlet which function to prevent the backward flow of blood back into the heart chambers. When describing eye anatomy, Imusina explains about how our eyes see things. It is when the light beams from the object penetrate through our eyes, it means our visibility becomes possible. Furthermore, he also identifies six extra ocular muscles and eye nerves. In anatomy of osteology and spine, he emphasized an association between the size and shape of vertebrae and its function. He explained the overall system of the spine and identified each subsection in the spine like thoracic vertebrae, lumbar vertebrae, costigial vertebrae, and sacrum. He also provides an efficient treatment for tendon rupture, which is suturing. Suturing is used to hold body tissues together after a surgery. In the canon of medicines, Ibn Sina states the parts and types of bone dislocation and bone fractures. When bone fractures are remarkable, instead of using tight bandaging, Ibn Sina prescribed from applying it because tight bandaging can obstruct the blood supply to the extremity. If this happens, that person will experience compartment syndrome. 
accomplished it may see now make significant and long-lasting contributions to almost all fields of science. He gives an initial description of the anatomy of an organ system before discussing its disease. His famous book, Canon of Medicine, became a standard medical text and could not be overshadowed by other medical references from all over the world. So now, you guys already know about Ibn Sina, right? Wow! He's such a genius! He mastered in lots of fields. And the most important thing is his knowledge not only useful for Michelle, but also for the woman. So now, shut your laptop down, open your book, and happy studying! Can't you see more? Take a hand. Women's eyes, women's eyes, women's eyes.